as usual, we've been hard at work here at Anderson Seed and Garden, and we've been propagating plants in our OxyClone cloning system. And basically, it's a hydroponic system. There's a, a water bath in here. You take cuttings off of a, a parent plant, and you can turn those cuttings into individual plants. So it's really, really easy to do. And uh, basically, Take your pruners, we're going to make a little cutting off of, uh, off of our parent plant here. And you can do this with all kinds of different plants. Some of course are quicker than others, but uh, we just take a little cutting and uh, what we're going to do is we're going to take that small cutting and we're going to take it and put it in these little styrofoam discs. And the styrofoam discs just hold the plant so that the, the where that's going to root will go down into the water. So we're just going to place that right inside our little disc and as you can see where I've made the cutting that will just like sit down into the water and I'm going to show you how it works but uh, take that place it into our cloning system fill this up with water don't even have to put any rooting hormone or anything in there I actually put a little bit of a natural uh, plant extract in there this is called HB 101 and this is uh, formulated in Japan. It's been used by 16 generations of uh, Japanese horticulturalists in their nursery and how they propagate and, and get their plants to grow. It's, it's amazing stuff. So it's, it acts like a fertilizer, but it's really more of a, it's a lot of, lot of plant hormones and uh, growth regulators in there. You have an air stone inside the, the, the cloning system. So we've got an air pump. So this like takes air, pushes it through an air stone inside. So kind of like a kind of like an aquarium. It's going to aerate the water. And then we also have a pump inside here which circulates the water as well too. So the water is constantly circulating and constantly getting aerated. And what it does when uh, you let it stay in here for a couple weeks. This is this is three weeks of growth. Now these uh, angel face ivies are really slow to root so they take a long time. But in three weeks we've been able to get them to, to do this. And so as you can see all the roots that have come off of our cuttings, uh, the, the cloning system works amazingly well. So we've taken all these little teeny tiny cuttings like the one that I just showed you. So we started with 20 small cuttings that looks just like that. And in three weeks we've turned those cuttings into 20 new plants. And so uh, this weekend we'll take those rootings and we'll transplant them into a four inch pot, get them rooted in soil, and then uh, shortly thereafter we'll have a whole bunch of ivies to uh, give away to some friends or, you know, plant it. You know. Depends on what you're doing. You know, we did sweet potatoes last year. We started all of our own sweet potatoes, transplanted those out, harvested sweet potatoes last fall. So the cloning system is a great way to get your plants to root very quickly. I've tried a lot of different rooting systems. This one is by far the fastest and the most efficient at producing roots uh, like, uh, like you just saw there. But uh, once you get those plants cloned, so basically these are genetically identical to its parent we can root those, transplant them, and they'll turn into you know, beautiful ivies just like this in just a short amount of time. So a uh, rooting system like the OxyClone, uh, so easy to use, doesn't take much time or effort, but if you do it right with the water bath and just a little bit of uh, plant growth regulator, uh, you can have a whole bunch of uh, new plants off of uh, your parent plant that you want to uh, want to reproduce. So very easy to do and we can show you here at Anderson Seed and Garden how to use your new cloning system if you want to give it a shot.